Live in high definition, this is WSBT News Saturday Morning. Out here, there are no guarantees. Those who live off the land do so at nature's mercy. And after a disastrous drought, this, for some, is a bleak business. But what if the weather didn't matter? It smells amazing. <laughs> Inside a new Buffalo warehouse, growers couldn't care less if it's cloudy or sunny, rainy or dry. On this farm, it doesn't make a difference. Underneath the, the foam board, the, the roots hang out in the water. And you won't find a grain of dirt. They don't need that. I, the whole farm revolves around this. It makes one revolution in about 50 minutes. Cylindrical planters that slowly rotate, constantly dipping into water laced with nutrients. They say the gentle movement speeds up growth. The design saves water. Plus, they're easy to stack. Other plants are grown in foam trays. Workers harvest crops like basil almost daily. These are actually some of our smaller leaves. And even that's not enough to meet demand. So each week right now, we're adding about 5,000 plants. So what we'll have in this space at the end of the month will be the equivalent to 100 acres of farmland in about 7,000 square feet. On top of that, Green Spirit runs organic vertical farms in Atlanta, Philadelphia, Canada, and the United Kingdom. They even serve their lettuce and tomatoes at the Summer Olympics. They're hoping investors in other cities will take interest and realize what they can do with an empty building. Ted Land, WSBT Channel 22 News.